know who this little girl gonna be. You already know. It's never switched. You can see by the title. <laughs> by the thumbnail, the girl's back with another. Back with something different today. I'm here with you know, no face, no case. D, this bit. <laughs> anyway, basically, we just, he gonna give his you know, the male perspective of what you know, what is really the definition of a real woman, whatever case may be. But before we continue, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, get a little ring a ding 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 dong, ring a ding 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 dong. <laughs> yeah, you did. So, y'all, basically, this video is just gonna be like getting them, like, basically helping the ladies. You know what I'm saying? Understand like what's the definition? Like how do y'all define a real woman? Cause you know, it's different definitions. You know, in my mind, I got a definition, but I mean, I'm not a male. You know what I'm saying? It's more for the for the you know what I'm saying for the the fellas. But before we continue, y'all know I got one thing to say. So are y'all ready? Are y'all sure? <laughs> All right. <clears throat> hey y'all. It's me, Lil Jell on the beat. It's me, Lil Jell on the beat. Hey, it's Lil Jell on the beat. No, 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 cause what? That part is scary. Like music with the glitzy, glitzy gang. I know that you did the best game in the world, in America, in the century. You know what I'm saying? Song coming soon. Gotta find the producer, but we gonna get on that later. So, you ready to dive into this topic? That's not even a question. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. So, how how do men define the, the like? A, a, a good woman like what's your, def what's your definition uh let me just put this out there too i'm gonna tell both sides okay because okay. it's two sides that people don't understand because there's a difference between a man and a boy or just a person that's learning and growing over time okay 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 i like that i like that so to define i'm gonna just speak one point of view right now so to define a perfect woman in a young person's eyes is someone that's always going to be there, be on his side, and just show love and caring, and at the same time you do what you want and shit. But at the same time, too, that's young people mindset, and we just have to grow out of it. A man's point of view of a perfect woman is she's on her shit, she don't even need to really ask him for shit because she got everything on her own, and it's how it's supposed to be, really, in my opinion. And on top of that, too, is she don't got to question her love for him. I like that. Okay, okay. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. But what's the care like the like the characteristics, the traits, like like when y'all say y'all looking for a good woman, like what exactly are y'all looking for in that good woman? Yeah, she on her stuff, but like, you know what I'm saying? Like Okay. Well, mine's I'ma put mine's out first. Cause I'm about to go off of mine what I'm thinking right now. A, per a perfect woman in my eyes is, of course everyone, I don't care what nobody say, love is an easy for their word to say but not do. But everyone has that picture in their head that like, what is their type? Really, we don't know what our future holds for us and it can be an opposite type, it can be whatever, but I have a specific type in my head. I don't speak on it, I'ma just, you feel me, let God take his course. So, as you got that image in your head, you would distract yourself too of what's actually in front of you. And my eyes, a perfect woman, is she works her job, she knows what she wants, and she's gonna get it, not even a question of asking it. And she's not scared to really be herself. A lot of good women out here is like, they they postpone they self and really showing their real self is just because they got so much feeling and shit too. And that's why everybody on that medication and drugs, you feel me? Because they hide their feelings and God, he put everybody on this earth for a reason. We all supposed to show love and affection, but just this world and in general where we at and that, it's just so much hate and negativity people not seeing. Right, right, right. But see, I've heard like from guys, dudes, the male species, you know, they like, oh, she gotta cook, she gotta clean, she gotta do this, this, and this, and this, and that. But it's like, are you looking for a wife or are you looking for a slave? Are you looking for a wife or are you looking for a maid? You know what I'm saying? I can speak on that too, really. That, some, it's guys like that too. And that, I'm gonna be honest, it's not really our fault because that's how we got to talk to Ray. Right. Because they can grow up and then they mother, she can just be staying at home, cooking, cleaning, and doing all of it. Right. Or another person, they can just see the woman doing everything and the man stay at home. In my opinion, it shouldn't be like that, but in general, we don't know their situation. Right. So, really, it shouldn't be based off of 
what you know and think. It should be based off what y'all both feel. Right. So if, one, if a woman don't want to stay home and watch the kids and whatnot too, y'all both got to talk it out and make a, your own understanding because once you have other people in the mix, you fucking it up. Because when you question something, you don't understand it. When you ask your homeboys or this and that, no one knows your woman besides really you. Okay, so then that brings me to this to this controversial topic is the man paying the bills. Now, a man has been taught to provide and leave, but when it's time to provide and leave, it's like, oh, you just females this, females that, but that's like me. Like, I was taught the man's supposed to pay the bills. I didn't see my dad pay all the bills. He done had, you know, women. Yes, she couldn't clean, but she still had her own. She still had her own. He's he mess. But then I also seen the other side where he stayed with a woman. He still cooked and cleaned. You know, as a man, he's still gonna provide, but it's just like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when it comes to this topic, a lot of men just like got so much to say when it's just like, as a man, you're supposed to provide. Not saying like, don't get me wrong, like me, if it's me, like, don't get me wrong, yeah, that's what I was taught. But I mean, I feel like if I'm living in the house, you know, I'm gonna go in on something. I don't know, it's just, just me, but at the same time, it's just like, if you my man, you supposed to lead to provide, you know what I'm saying? But hey, so you, you talking about cooking and cleaning and stuff like that, but that's the same thing for women, for 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 a female. Like we done seen some who have their fathers and they like like done seen, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, how can y'all say y'all want a woman that you know got her on her own things like that? But when it's time for y'all to do y'all part and lead and stuff, it's like, oh, but you just want me for my money, yada yada yada, or I'm not supposed to pay all the bills and this 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 and this and that. So what? What's the, what's the word on that? You know what I'm saying? What's the word on that is because we still are young and we young minded and at the same time we should head strong like I told you before and looks can be assumed and meaning that maybe just the relationship they had before might have fucked up their head. Right, right. So they can just automatically assume it's supposed to be this and that and that's why we have so many social issues because so much toxic and hate and ain't nothing wrong with you have a little toxic this and that and shit when it's needed. But if you have it 24 7 and that's who you always push off that's the energy you always gonna think of your own mind so even though you say you don't but you do so with the whole man paying everything a woman paying everything it's a difference where y'all young in my opinion if y'all both on y'all shit i think it should be equal but sure, the older sure. you get and if it's kids stepping in line too the man need to pay I ain't saying more, but they need to pay a specific bill. Meaning that like if you pay for the man pay for rent, it's a bigger amount and then the woman pay for all utilities, it'd probably be two hundred, maybe three hundred less. Then that's just something it's supposed to be like that. The reason why I said it is cause as you grow up, your son gonna see that. And your son is gonna he start realizing what is a man without achievement accent. So they need to see it for themselves. That's what a lot of people don't understand. When people say they know what they want and when they get it, after a while they just it's sitting there or it's just they just think about like damn that's not really what I wanted or like this is what I've been waiting for. They don't have really an end goal. And that's the thing, people don't have an end goal what they really want. Right, right. And that's why it just needs to fall and everything needs to be natural. Don't think of the next person. Don't think of what your family and whatnot do. Because at the end of the day, your family did raise you. All right. But then it's your turn to like make your own path and not copy off of someone else. Right, right, right. So, so, okay, speaking from your point of view, when you're looking for your, your good woman, like what do you specifically look for like that she has going on? What I look for yeah. is really just time. Time? And I ain't saying I gotta know her schedule, but at the same time too, I gotta know how she moves, meaning that for me, I look different. So if I know a woman is doing college or she's just working 24 seven or something like that, right. when I know she's busy and she gave me that time to actually talk to me, mm -hmm. that's that, that's, it hit different because at the same time too, mm -hmm. you know shit ain't easy and people ain't looking at right. that. Right. The second thing is the dedication that the motherfucker put in. For sure, for sure. For sure. Dedication go a long way. Loyalty, loyalty can go a long way too. But I don't look at like, I don't look at loyalty, love or nothing. I look at the bond. So it's just gonna be natural meaning that like, if I'm finna like, we let's say we swimming, you feel me? Mm -hmm. we face deep, we diving on motherfucker. And then 
No, let me rewind it. We on the cliff, taking the picture. I'm finna fall off, woo woo. And then your phone, like you had a choice to grab your phone or me and shit like that. I don't want you to even look at your phone. Your first thing is to grab me. Okay, yeah, okay, I see that's how you That's the bomb yeah. I'm talking about. Yeah. It's just not even a question. It's just gonna be natural. And that's how it's supposed to be, in my opinion. Everyone has a different opinion. But a, di a different, now, if I'm speaking through a nigga opinion, a brother opinion, you feel me, it can go different. Because a brother, like, he need a chick to hold her down, cook, clean, you feel me, yeah, give her that, yeah. that sloppy toppy, you know, solid like a rocket, you feel me? <laughs> solid. And just, in general, have that image what they think they see. Right. Meaning that, like, Shit, if you're supposed to be my, you know, my, you feel me? I'm, I'm gonna put that bleep, you feel me? Right. And at the same time, too, they just think that's what it's supposed to be. And after but, a while, do you, but do you also think, like, these, like, the rappers and the music that we listen to also influence, like, the male generation of, of how they, how do I say, like, the woman that they're looking for is just like, oh, well, you get me, like, oh, she, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, they always, you know, Man, like if the song says shut the fuck up, little bitch. Just yeah, like, like you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, like you feel like music and the rappers like play a big role. Of, well, of course, it does do play a big role, but at the same time, too, that's just a part about being strong minded. For sure. And on top of that, too, you can't even say like all the like the nigga music and shit, too, because the nigga music females listen to that shit. And now it's just like roles reverse niggas is bitch, niggas is bitches, and bitches is niggas. <laughs> Boy, for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure, because let me tell you, but I don't know, I feel like, the, the, I feel like a good, I don't know, I feel like a good woman is like, it's really hard to like be one, not like far as like doing their job, not that part, like far as like really showing because, you know, dudes of this generation, like, they done been through so much, so they, they feel like every female is the same, and then like, I don't, I see all the time on social media, like, like dudes really quoting lyrics and like, yeah, you they it's like first of all, I'm not your bitch. That's 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 what turns me off. Don't call me out my name. You either gonna and, and that's the thing, whatever you put out is what you get. So if you said these hoes ain't nothing, that's cause you mess with a hoe. Like, of course these hoes ain't nothing. They're hoes. Hoes don't give a you know, they don't care about this stuff, they're hoes. Let me tell you, you know this though. Hold on. Like, this is what you get out. If you call into a girl directly versus saying it, it's different because you gotta say it like this, like, man, I'm tired of bitches, woo woo, this and that. And you could be looking at them like a different way. And that's another way about being strong minded. He can say, man, he tired of bitches, he tired of hoes, this and that and shit, you feel me? Because he's repeating his life. But at the same time, too, he's not directing it to you. You're a woman. You're right, you're right. You're but that's what I'm saying. Like, you can't get mad and be like, oh, these hoes ain't nothing. Duh, they're hoes. Like, it's a category. You know what I'm saying? Hoes is a category. It's just it's a category. Women, white, it, it's a category. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, at some point, y'all gotta be like, well, dang, I did choose a hoe. Like, you knew what it was when you got with her. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, that's like me. That's like when some dudes, like, they don't like, like, this one dude that I knew or would talk to way back when, he was like, don't call me a nigga because I'm not a nigga. Okay, I got you. you young man, grown man, whatever your case may be, I got you. Some some dudes don't like to be called nigga. That's, so, that's understandable. But it's a category. Like, if you saying hoes ain't shit, Duh, it's a she a hoe. She hoes don't care about themselves. Like you know what I'm saying? Like it's a category to it. And that's but, all you know about saying? growing up. That too. We gotta learn on our own and shit. That too. We like I said, we all hard We all head strong. For sure, for sure. I'm we think shit. All right. But like I was all saying, right. we just gotta. That's the best way about like life. It, life is hard and when you feel like giving up, that's just, you feel me? It just shows you how strong you are and at the same time too, your past always reflected. So when people just sit in one spot and overthink shit or just in general, just be deep in your thoughts and feelings, that's when the music come into play because you, you fall back to that old shit. You gotta hop out your comfort zone at the same time too. The more you sit and wait is the more time that you just, I ain't saying wasting time, but just gotta take it a day at a time. For sure, for sure. The more you build up and just let this shit hold you, is where that's where you're worrying about the next person. And you worried about this, that, and the third. You need to worry about your next move and your next soul and like. Preach, 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 bro. Cause it's a whole circle. Cause niggas not seeing it. Cause in their head, like I said, it looks can be assuming, but niggas just automatically assume shit, just like our females assume shit. Cause it's the past. Yeah. But that's the thing though, like. 
You're supposed to learn from that situation and then you're supposed to move forward. For sure. That's the best way I can say it. And a definition of a perfect wife is do what you need to be told, but at the same time, you don't need to say nothing. Okay, I like that. Yeah, I never, I've never, you know, heard a dude put it that way, but for sure, for sure. Listen, if y'all want to, if y'all want to do a part two of this topic, make sure y'all comment down below. Get this video to 50 likes, y'all. Come on, it'll take nothing but two seconds to hit that like button. Um, make sure y'all subscribe to his channel. Uh, the channel. It's recess full time. Recess full time. You know what I'm saying? One of those slash we say the best and shit. If you like it, come on, tune into the next. Okay, okay. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you tell the dead homies, the goldfish, the birds, everybody, everything to like. Comment and subscribe because we only going it up this whole year. You did what I'm saying. Glitzy Gate taking over 2021. Big things popping. Look, they stop it. Let's get to the money. <laughs> we out this thing. Yes.